dear students welcome back to our channel easy explanation in this tutorial we will be learning about how to use function to check whether the given number is palindrome number or not so uh, i already have discussed the concept of palindrome number in detail in the previous videos so please like if you want to know about them please visit our channel and now let us start the code to print whether the given number is palindrome number or not as include stdio dot h then main int num and this is the number we will be checking for palindrome enter a number scanning percentage t percent num So now what we'll do is we'll write a code to reverse the number. I'll write a function to reverse the given number. I'll name this function as get underscore reverse of this number num. So now the control will transfer to get reverse function. I'll write get reverse function now. Get reverse of int and now how to reverse a given number so while n is greater than 0 I'll calculate, calculate the remainder rem since remainder variable is not declared I will declare it there in rem comma sum equals to 0 to store the sum value so remainder equals to n modulus 10 and sum is equals to sum into 10 plus remainder and n equals to n divided by 10 I'll return the reverse of I'll return the reverse to the main function again by using the return statement return the sum value because the sum variable contains the reverse of this given number now you can see we have a sum which is of integer data type so return type of the is function will be int and i'll store the value returned by get reverse function in reversed okay reverse num now if the original number which is num is double equals to or equals to rcd reversed num then we'll say printf percentage t is a palindrome number and it is num else in depth percentage t is not a palindrome number and num and this so after that return 0 and write the function prototype at the top control c Control V So this is function proto type. It acts as a signature of the given function and this is function definition. So this is the code to check whether the given number is palindrome number or not. Please have a good look at it. Let us run this code now. Compile and run. I will write 121. 121 is a palindrome number. P missed A here. 
वन फोर सिक्स फोर वन सिक्स फोर सिक्स वन सो इट इज अ पैरेंट ऑफ नंबर इफ यू लाइट इन अदर नंबर लाइक इट इज अ पैरेंट ऑफ नंबर एंड आई विल राइट वन टू थ्री इज नॉट अ पैरेंट ऑफ नंबर सो नाउ यू कैन सी दैट this code is working perfectly fine i hope every one of you have understood the concept of how to check whether the given number is palindrome or not by using function so if you have any queries regarding this or any topic of c programming language please mention in the comment section and please like share and subscribe our channel for more related videos on c programming language Till then, bye bye everyone.